All right, I just, I missed my initial reaction to this, but for some reason, Lumion Legacy is now called uh, Lelamian Legacy. This doesn't give me hope for the new Lumion, does it? What do you mean it's lame? Anyway, I completely forgot to do the mastery for Sherbot, and I just never did it, so I guess we'll see what I could get, and of course, it's nothing interesting. Okay, so, uh, you know, I didn't really think about this, but I don't know where to even begin. Also, I'm recording on the Roblox Windows app this time, because last time when I was trying to hunt for Sherbot, that was absolute hell. Because for some reason, you just can't record on Roblox anymore without the thing just crashing every two seconds. So, you know, it just hit me that the game was not supposed to, it wasn't supposed to be Lamian Legacy. I'm very certain it was supposed to be Llama, Lamian. Whoops. Anyway, I saw exactly one person say that it might be in Route 1. I have nothing to go off of, so why not? I gotta say, if it really is in Route 1, that is an interesting spot to put a new Lumion in. Okay, well, I gotta say, you know, that's not what I was looking for um, in the slightest. So, with that being said... Okay, you know what, to distract me from this long hunt, because it's been 10, specifically like 12 minutes, and I still haven't found anything. People are saying you can go inside the Rally Ranch building now. And apparently that's how people figured it out. Uh, oh, okay, well, I just got spoiled. Eh. Wow, that really is just a llama. Anyway, I wish I knew about this earlier. I would have done this first. Hey there. Are you tracking the grazing patterns of Lamba as closely as I am? Oh, well, don't worry about it. I'm sure you're busy. Lamba can currently be found grazing on Route 1. I'm excited to see where they go next. Oh, so they change locations. That's actually an interesting idea. They're such funny little guys. I'm just curious what the odds of this thing are. I've literally been hunting for over 10 minutes, and now I'm getting back into it. Also, I've learned that this is a permanent Lumion being added to the game, which makes sense. I mean, the way they worded it on the tweet was very much intentional. Like how they were saying, there's a new Lumion being added to Roria. It was very odd, so it's not really a surprise to me, but you know, it's nice. I'm honestly more interested in having new permanent Lumions in the game to further build this world instead of just another event Lumion. If only I could actually find this thing, though. And the thing I'm curious about is if Lamba's grazing patterns change by day. Because they don't... I mean, I literally just read what the character said, and I don't remember what she said, but I don't think they actually gave a time frame of when it changes. I can only assume it's every day it changes. Because that would be awkward if I'm just sitting here in Route 1 and... All of a sudden, oh, you can only find it in Route 3. This update has been out for half an hour. I have been recording for 26 mi- Of course. J you know, there's a joke I was gonna say, but never mind. Anyway. Lamba. I ain't gonna- it- Its design isn't- Uh, extremely impressive. It is just a llama, but- Llamas are cute, so I don't care. This thing could literally just evolve into a bigger llama, and I'd still like it. So, yeah. There's that. And I believe it evolves at level 18, and there is a final evolution that people have not figured out yet. Which is... Interesting. That is a very weird sound. Anyway. Uh... It's got one oddly miscolored patch of something on its fur. And other than that, it is a llama. Wait a minute. Oh, well that's interesting. Now there's arrows. What a random quality of life improvement. Well, uh, lore time. Where'd he go? Lamba always stay close to their parents in the wild. When they feel threatened by an enemy, they will often spit at their opponent. 
This tactic often catches their opponents off guard, allowing them time to escape. So now to uh, grind some levels. And then I have no idea what to do after that because no one else has any idea what to do after this. What the heck? What the? What kind of a move is that? Daydream. Get lost in thought. This move does nothing to help with the battle. Wh why is... Why is that a move? You know what? I'm keeping that in my move set because I bet you that has a gimmick to it. Alright, I somehow managed to get Lamba at level 20 instead of 18. But here's its first... I... That Lumion Cry sure is something. Anyway. I have... Zero idea where this is going other than like some cloud dreaming thing based off of that one move that I've never seen before. What in the hell? Why does it look like a bunny? Choo choo. Oh, oh my god. Choo choo. You. I gotta admit, that's amazing. That's a great name. Choo choo. It doesn't even get a signature move when it evolves. It just gets headbutt. Again, I am really curious what these little patterns are supposed to be. Also, Jesus stretching on that. Why do it looks so much like a bunny? I mean, it's cute. I'll give it that. I Choo Choo are incredibly picky eaters and spend most of their time in pursuit of pastures full of lush green grass. Once they find a favorable place to eat, they will not leave the area until they've consumed everything. Now that would be hilarious if you go over to Route One the next day and there's just no grass. I'm just curious. Is no one's figured it out yet on how to evolve it for its final evolution. And I don't know what to do either, so I... Uh, gonna have to play a bit of a waiting game, I guess. Man, I am seeing like 35 million different ways of evolving this thing. I got it at level 30 because some people are saying you feed it a power fruit inside of Route 1. That didn't work. Now people are saying, you need to have another llama in your party, or two llamas. What in the world? Also, I am very paranoid because people are saying that the, uh... Final Evolution does not look good. But, that's for me to judge and not for other people to judge. So, yeah. Uh, I guess we just play the waiting game. Again. Okay, I have gotten myself another long... Oh, right. I'm like, where'd where it go? Okay. I got myself a Lamba. I have another one now. And I am going to see if leveling it up again is going to work with the Lamba and the party. There we go. Okay. So that's what you have to do. I can only assume the reason why you need two llamas is because it's Llama Train Studio and, and, and there's multiple people and they work together as a group and they grow stronger as a group and evolve. At least that makes sense to me. Anyway, people are saying this design is bad, but I'm also hearing people say that the design is basic. And if that's the only reason why people are saying it's bad, I'm curious. I, its eyes are different, but other than that, that ain't a bad design. Like, sure, it's just a llama, but who cares? Not everything needs to be such an insanely detailed, unique thing. Like, you know, in this world, Lumians are just animals. There's some animals that look weird because they're not animals in the normal world, but sometimes there's going to be animals that just look like a normal animal. I think this is cute looking. I do think its eyes look a little... They're not weird, but it's different. Which I guess by that definition kind of means it is weird, but... I don't know. I mean, I think it... Nah, it definitely is the face. 
Other than that, I mean, it's... It's really not a bad design. Again, I'll keep saying it. It is just a llama, but who cares? Like, did I even read the lore of this? Yes, I did. Okay. Lumala. Lumala can eat an entire acre of grass in a single day, thanks to its eight stomachs. What? The food it consumes is mixed with its stomach acid and can be regurgitated and spat at its enemies. That's gross. Anyway, they're definitely going to need to uh, expand the Lumipedia again. Because we are literally right on top of the roamers. Well, overall, not... Really not bad. I think, honestly, it's kind of nice to have something a bit different. You know, not just... Oh, here's another insane, like, really insane, really cool design. So much detail packed into it. You know, it's just a nice llama-inspired Lumion. And I think it's pretty cute. I Really, my only gripe is the face, but I think it's mainly just because it's quite different. And also, they're doing this thing again where, for some reason, they're putting, like, cartoony outlines on the model. Which is a little... Like, I mean, it helps with contrast and whatnot, and makes the uh, indentation of the mouth much more clear, but I don't think it's necessarily needed. But yeah, the eyes are definitely, they're different, and I think that's mainly, that's my main gripe with the design, but that's more just a personal nitpick. Other than that, it's cute. I like it. And, uh, I guess that's really all there is to say, you know? You got Lamba, you got Choo Choo, and you got Lumala. Yeah, I think some people were expecting, I don't know, I guess it's something a bit more unique, being like an actual llama, like in a train, or having the design kind of incorporate train-like elements into it. And I think, I feel like that's the main reason people are saying it's a quote-unquote bad design is just because... It didn't really meet their expectations. Other than that, I mean, I think it's... I think it's a nice little Lumion. And I think it's pretty cute. And it's a good addition to the game. You know? So, uh, with that being said... I'm pretty sure I covered everything. And... Yeah, I'll be back next week to see... Whatever Lumion is getting a gem reskin, and am I gonna bother getting every single one of the gem reskins? Hell no. But, um, you know, I just don't got the time for that stuff nowadays. And also, uh, just don't care for the same thing but different color type reskins anymore. So, yeah, I'll definitely check it out, though. I'll get a couple of the gems and then probably just call it quits after like an hour or something. And that'll be all that video is going to be next week, probably. So, yeah. I'll be back whenever that comes out. And I'll see you again next time.